When should we update SPT? I frequently get comments languishing over the recent frequency of updates, be it for SPT or the mods. Of course, it is necessary for users to worry about SPT updating on its own and breaking one thing or another, the entire application is offline. What's more, users are never required to update their files under any circumstances, regardless of what issues updated files may fix. In general, it's advisable to at least check the file base dashboard once every couple of days. It's got featured mods, those recently added, and recent comments posted by users at the bottom. Typically, players will be watching watchful for updates to their favorite mods and get them as soon as they appear, often keeping their installation of SPT entirely up to date besides. Even the SPT version update is an outpatient procedure now, with 3.9 users enabled to drag and drop new files into their current installation. There aren't any services that track updates for specific mods, at least none that I know of. The SPT pub discord server has a channel for any new upload to the file base, but the site's front page is likely the quickest way to check for mod activity. Because the entirety of the application is offline and doesn't connect to any remote servers or exchange account information, no files or mods get updated automatically. If a new version is released, even of SPT itself, users will need to acquire and install it themselves every time and there's no requirement or rule regarding out-of-date installations. Like with most modern software that's still in development but used aggressively by a very active community, SPT and its mods receive updates rather frequently. Each version is mostly stable for the conditions it was released for and can be kept if there aren't any problems. There's a lot of gameplay potential on SPT with mods, so it's expected that many users will work towards a single stable installation and keep it for weeks or months. As long as nothing breaks and live EFT updates don't prevent their usage, those users may as well stick with their configs and enjoy them for as long as possible. Avid players, advanced users, and developers tend to watch closely for updates and change notes for everything in the SPT scene without a care for the work of it all. We make lists and web pages for the mods and configurations we use and share the updates with one another as soon as we spot them. It's an addiction, really. But is all that really necessary? Should you update SPT and the mods with all haste? <laughs> no, not at all. Play at your speed, keep your backups in case anything breaks, and enjoy yourself. There's a lot to do, plenty to explore, so many new tasks to complete for awesome rewards, there's no need to rush into any of it. Just remember to check the places, file-based dashboard, discord, and reddit, every so often to keep up with any major changes and play as you like. If you'd like to know more about just what tends to be updated with SPT versions of the mods, let me know in the comments. We can discuss game modding in general to really understand the scene and what it's like for all parties involved if it'll help. In the meantime, I hope that this video is informative for you in regards to handling SPT updates. Be sure to like and subscribe for more, I'll be back soon with another video.